We've had a few fans die on our 2821 series routers. Here's a short video on how to replace them. Start by unscrewing all the screws that hold the top plate of the router. Then lift the plate from the back of the router towards the faceplate in an upwards motion. The fans are a single unit found on the right side of the router. Remove the faceplate on the front to gain access to another screw holding the fans in place. Now, gently remove the power cables. There are three, one for each fan, remembering where they were plugged into. Finally, there are three more screws to remove on the side of the router that hold the fans in place. Now you can lift the single unit containing the three fans out of the chassis. Now reversing the process, place the replacement fan into the chassis. Line it up with the three screw holes on the side and screw the fans into the place, followed by the screw on the front of the router. Insert the power cables back into their corresponding pins, carefully ensuring they fit snug. Tuck the power cables into the grooves on the fan housing to ensure a neat setup. Now reattach the faceplate the correct way up, slide it into place. Insert the top plate at a nearly vertical angle to set it in the grooves, then pull it closed. Screw the plate back down. And finally, mount the router back into the rack and power it on. Now we're working with three new fans.